I'm super excited. What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's Nikki. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I really do love you for it. So on today's video, I'm super excited because in previous videos I've been talking to you guys about me buying a vlogging camera. And so from the title, I know you already see that I finally decided and I finally got one. So I'm super, super excited to unbox it and throw in a little, little bit of review just from my initial thoughts of it. I may put a little bit of footage in there. I'm not sure. We'll see how it goes. But for now, I just really am excited to unbox it. The other day, actually, when I received it, I opened it a little bit and I was like, no, 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 no. I definitely got to make a video for this. So if you're excited for this video like I am, Go ahead and hit that like button. It looks kind of like this below. Helps me out a tremendous amount. Doesn't cost you a darn. <laughs> so if you're new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button and help me get up to 1,100 subscribers by the end of the year. <laughs> That's one of my goals, right? I did ask for suggestions in the other videos of which cameras I should buy. And I really had, um, got down to about three cameras and I said, well, heck, let me just go ahead, get this camera. It's a starter camera. I get that, but I'm a starter YouTuber. Anyway, without further ado, let me present the camera to you guys. Hey guys. So this is the box that the camera and its accessories came in. And so I'm going to go ahead and open it now with you guys. All right, this right here obviously is the packing list that um, came in the box just to let you know what to expect with the camera, right? It shows a price of $249, but I didn't pay that much for it because I had a few gift cards that I've just been holding in my purse. And I said, well, this is a fun time to use them. So I used those and I paid $189 for the camera and the accessories so we're going to look and see what all is in the box i'm going to lay this packing slip right here beside me and we're going to just go through and see what all we have in the box so this is called a ultimax blower and what this serves the purpose of from what i've seen sorry i had it so close to the camera but from what i've seen is you can um, clean off the lens, blow things off the lens of the camera with this, and that's what this is used for. Right here. This right here is the digital point and shoot carrying case for the camera. It comes with a shoulder strap for the carrying case, and I like it because it's super tiny, right? And um, it's just easy to carry. You don't have to fumble with a whole lot of stuff. This is the secure digital, micro secure digital um, reader and writer for the SD cards. And there's the SD card. So you can stick this in your computer to read off the information from this um, SD card from your camera. This right here is the obviously cord hdmi cord and it is a six foot cord let me go ahead and take that out of the packaging as well but this is a six foot cord hdmi i'm sure you guys know what this is used for you just plug it into the camera plug it into the computer so that you can transfer that data over as well so that's pretty neat cleaning cloth for the camera lens Make sure microfiber cloth, it says it on the back there. Have a, another tripod, and I say another because I did a video on a tripod that I purchased. 
if you guys want to go and check that out um, the link is in the description and the link for this will be in the description box too for this camera but it comes with a tripod which I think is super cool it comes with another tripod and this one is one of those ones that's adjustable and you can you know put it on a lot of different things and you know take good video without really having to have a helper right this right here is what they call a pistol grip tripod let's go ahead and open it but they um right here shows you six and a half mini tabletop tripod pistol grip so you can open it and sit it as a tripod like so hold it like this and the camera sits on top here is a pin brush tip right here on the end so you can clean the camera off any dust or debris And this is a little mini SD card wallet where you can keep several different SD cards in there, which I think is cool. And you should be able to fit it also in here, the carrying case as well. So that's pretty neat, guys. Listen, this camera came with a lot of different accessories, as you guys can see. Look at all these accessories that they came that it came with. And without further ado, let's take a look at the camera, which is right here. So excited. So this is the actual camera and user manual comes with it. Um, power cord for charging. battery charger which obviously this goes into for charging the battery and then before I get the camera out we've got a little string handle obviously where you can put in the camera for a better grip because you don't want to lose the camera while you're vlogging and then the battery I won't take that out of the packaging just yet but that is the battery guys and the camera oh my god I'm so excited I'm so excited look 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 super cool super cool look guys and I can't open it or anything but yet because obviously I don't have a battery in it but actually let me see if I can this is well let me show you guys a little bit about the camera first okay so this right here obviously is where the car goes and the battery goes um, open and lock this door using that little lever right there the one of my hesitations about buying this camera was that this is where the tripod goes so when the battery does die or you need to change out the sd card you have to take it off the tripod to do so but again i went ahead and just said well i'll deal with that part of it just to you know as a beginner so i'm cool with that um this right here is the actual camera here's the grip part of it right here um, the lens, obviously, it has a 25 times zoom, and it is a SX620HS Canon camera. On the top, obviously, is for um, moving the, the, I'm sorry, moving the optical zoom back and forth on and off button. This, I would imagine, is where the mic is. Um, correct me, guys, if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm right. But this right here is where the mic is the built-in mic um, and this right here is you know where you can change the zoom on and off button this is where the flash is and it pops up out of the camera this right here is whether you have the oh there it is where you have the flash on or not on the back of the camera it is 20 full hd 20.2 megapixels and um, it's either has you taking pictures or has you doing video. It's just a simple click. See? 
video or pictures, right? Um, this lets you play. This is the power button. And this, of course, is just different functionalities of the camera. I'm not going to go through all of that, guys. But um, I may put a little bit of that in a little bit later. But for now, I'm just kind of showing you guys what the buttons are, right? And then this is, I believe, the Wi-Fi button. And then this gets you to the menu. The screen is pretty big. As you guys can see, you can see the ring light in there. But it's a pretty wide screen. So that should be able to give you good video. Be able to see that. And then this is where the this goes. Right there. And then this right here is where the HDMI cords go. Right here. And that is all guys, that is my unboxing and semi-review of the Canon PowerShot SX620HS. I think I'm gonna be in love with the camera, um, but we'll see, I may do a follow-up once I get to using it and learning about it and everything like this. Again, I bring you these videos to kind of see what you're gonna get once you get it, as well as sometimes do a little small review on it if I can. I can say that I do love the fact that um, it's you know a tiny camera. It can fit in a lot of different places. It comes with a carrying case and all of that good stuff. Everything that you'll need in order to operate it well, it seems like you were provided with. So again, if you got some good information out of this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. I really would appreciate it. Go ahead and put your comments below. Also guys, just, you know, if you're new to the channel or if you've been watching my videos and haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Make some comments below. The link for it to Amazon will be below in the description box as well. So you can just click on that video and go straight to it and look at the specs and everything of this camera as well or cam cameras that are similar to it. All right. Well, again, guys, take care of yourself. Love yourself and love others, and I'll see you in the next video.